of Tierbed is another intersection designated OBJ Cross at grid square 046073. Both OBJ Tierbed and OBJ Cross will need to be under our control for friendly mechanized ar um, and armory elements to move into the AO. Um, during a recon uh, patrol er earlier this week, a small NATO patrol base has been spotted in the wood line to the north east of OBJ Cross, and the grid, uh, grid square is on that list as well. Uh, target considerations, a lot of dense forest, a lot of new growth. Um, there are three World War II era bunkers to the east, south, and west side of the village. There is a southern facing trench line. Uh, there's also a fuel depot on the north side of the village. We should do our best not to destroy this because the armor are probably gonna want to use that, some of that. Uh, there's a radio transmission tower on the southeast side of the village. We should also try to avoid destroying this. Um, in the village, there are several NATO tactical structures, including a command post with a radar station on top, a ma makeshift helipad on a rooftop nearby, and a radio relay. Uh, if we can, we should try to capture these, but if they are get, uh, need to get destroyed, if we just can't get birds in the air because they keep uh, early warning because of the radio or the relay, um, we'll hit them with mortars, destroy them, and then rebuild them once we take the town. Uh, next couple of slides are various pictures of the town and some fortifications. Um, we can expect approximately a platoon strength garrison present in Tierbed at all times. Uh, that number increases when a supply convoy comes through. Um, enemy armor has been spotted on a hilltop a kilometer west, uh, an Abrams and an M48 main battle tank. Um, middle left of this, we got the fuel depot, we got the radio tower. Uh, on the bottom, you can see that um, helipad there. Uh, they do have two MH6J Little Birds on the helipad uh, when this photo was taken. And then on that bottom right, that's a picture of one of the convoys going into Tierbed from Cross. They're usually lightly armed, a couple of Humvees. Uh, they don't seem to be the upper armored ones. Uh, inside Tierbed, not pictured, but was spotted, were other Humvees, including the M114, up armored with the uh, gun turrets. Um, fortifications. We can see the picture of the bunker. We got the... Uh, Radar station. Uh, there is a large supply depot on the southern side of Tirabad. Uh, a lot of shipping containers. That sounded expensive. I'm sure that'll get fixed. Um, on the top of the command post, Mark 19 grenade launchers have been seen. Um, that bottom left picture on page 7 is uh, part of the trench line. And then you can see another picture of uh, the helipad. Uh, note the sniper team up there uh, with long rifles. Uh, OBJ Cross. Uh, more Abrams have been seen guarding it, uh, as well as a warrior IFV. Uh, the middle right picture is a small topographical map of the area. The dark gray lines are fences. The thick gray line is a stone uh, wall. So we do have a little bit of cover there. Otherwise, it is completely out in the open. The bottom picture is the closest our operative could get to that NATO patrol base. It is mostly sandbags and camo netting. Um, doesn't look super like fortified, but there's about a squad size element defending it. Um, phase zero, that's what we're in currently, is getting your gear shit, um, uh, gear ready. Um, you guys heard the BM-21 rocket artillery saturating landing zones. Um, maybe they'll keep saturating after this briefing's done. Very fucking loud. Uh, kit list, blah, blah, blah. We'll move on to phase one. Aerial insertion. So we're going to go wheels up in about uh, 24 minutes at 0530 local. Uh, air assault infantry specialist teams and the mortar detachment are going to board MI-8TV and MI-8TW helicopters uh, and will be carried over the Austria checkboard to the landing zones north of OBJ Tirabad. We are going to be escorted by a K-52 alligator and an MI-28N. Uh, we have two LZs, the primary LZ and a secondary. Uh, after insertion, uh, helicopters are going to be performing one aerial bombardment of each objective before leaving the AO. They're going to be retasked by command to go hit other targets in the greater AO. Uh, if we get shot off of the primary uh, landing zone, we're going to have to land at the secondary and then retake the primary. The primary is the only one that's in range for the mortars to hit Tirabad. Uh, the secondary is just outside their maximum range, so we will need to retake the primary. Um, after we retake primary and set up the mortars, the main force, we're going to head southeast to OBJ Cross and the known NATO PB. Uh, the DMR team, which I believe is... Do we still have a DMR team? Is that Nick and who else? Is Nick even here? 
Where's Nick? Uh, it says on Messenger he won't be home till 9. Great. Okay, we don't have a DMR team. We are taking OBJ Cross first. Um, if we want to send a small fire team to go get eyes on Tirabad and just act as forward observers for the mortars, we can do that. I'll let the squad leader designate. Um, at OBJ Cross, uh, we're going to call for a fire mission uh, before we move in, and we're going to perform a dual assault on Cross and BPB. Um, after the assault begins, the mortar team is going to switch targets and just start shelling the fuck out of Tirabad. Um, like I said, if they have to start destroying some of those NATO uh, tactical structures, more power to them. Uh, the DMR team or whoever's out there, the forward observers are going to be guiding the sh those shots in. Um, after we get cross, um, we're going to uh, leave the heavy launcher team behind to hold the crossroads while all other teams assault Tirabad. Um, the DMR team or the recon team is going to also pull back at this time and head to cross, where everyone else will then shift back north and collapse back onto Tirabad down the hill um, and do it. Reinforcements are, uh, enemy reinforcements are likely to come from other garrisons during this, uh, via the southern MSR, uh, so we might need to send additional teams back to aid in uh, Cross's defense. Um, final phase, dig in and hold. Um, once we secure both OBJ Tirabed and OBJ Cross, we're going to call for a supply drop and build defensive positions. We're going to clear an area for a helipad, and then supplies are going to be brought in on some MI-8s. Once the supplies have arrived and are transitioned to uh, base storage, uh, leadership is going to identify and place fortifications in key locations around the um, objective. Sandbag walls, bunkers. Uh, I believe we get some AGSs that they're planning on letting us use, so we'll be able to set up some of those at uh, different crossroads and choke points. Um, Cross is likely outside of the range of the command post base management, so infantry tasks there are going to need to dig trenches. Um, Tierbin and Cross are then going to be held until the 901st are relieved by the 7th Panzer Division. Additional waves of friendly infantry will be brought in on new, the new helipad on the MS, or the MSR between Tierbin and Cross, uh, whatever is most secure at the time. Uh, um, enemy courses of action for this operation. Most likely, NATO calls for reinforcements from a nearby garrison during the assault on Tirabad. Reinforces are going to likely be lighter mechanized infantry and maybe some armor, artillery, and air support. Most dangerous course of action is a heavy combined arms assault to retake Tirabad and Cross. As Harrison Smith put it, uh, Abrams, lots of Abrams. Uh, some special considerations. Uh, for radios, this AO is fucking huge. Uh, we need to use the manpack radios. The spawning on them has been disabled, but we need them for the longer range. Uh, medevac and medical kits. Uh, for any injuries that are noted as high blood loss, uh, keep track of those yourself. The wounded are going to need to be flown back to the field hospital just outside this building uh, for treatment. After we're treated, um, they'll be reinserted with a subsequent wave of infantry. If Tirabed and Cross are not under friendly control, the pickups are going to need to be held at the primary LZ. Flight Medic. Uh, Flight Medic, who are you? Uh, that would be me. Okay. Uh, you're going to be carrying the medical kit, so you can place that or use it to resupply people's personal medical supplies. Uh, if you walk up to somebody while you hold the medical kit in your hand, you can give somebody um, bandages, morphine, and uh, I guess tourniquets if you want to, to refill their supplies. Or you can use it to heal somebody. Um, you can either redistribute or heal. Uh, launcher team. So we have, I believe, we don't have a heavy launcher team. We're just using the RPGs. Um, so I don't, we don't have to go over the lock-on, but for future uh, events, make sure you guys set your lock-on uh, keybind. Otherwise, your uh, lock-ons will not work. Um, E-tools. Everybody's got an E-tool, right? That is a red line item. If you don't have an E-tool, go grab one after this brief is done. Uh, they are required for building base structures and defenses, as well as digging trenches. To build, you're going to equip an E-tool Walk up to a structure blueprint. It'll be a transparent, like, white ghost outline. And then hold F on PC by default. Um, f up to five people can build an item together at a time. Or actually, more, really. But uh, each bar is, like, 20% of the structure. So it takes a while to do it. Um, for trenches, you take your E-tool out, hold R, and then press R where you want the trench to be in front of you. And then it will place another one of those ghost blueprints. You can hold R again to exit building mode, and then F to build, like, normal. Um, please don't build trenches all over the place because they are physical objects, and if we build too many, they might lag the game out. Um, so just try to build them in like key areas. Uh, mortars. The mortars have a approximately a 30-second hang time from fire to impact. So uh, leadership, me, uh, Harrison, Lane, 
calls for fire missions should be made early. Um, but mortar team, feel free, especially when we're assaulting one objective, feel free to hit the other one um, and just start uh, saturating the target. Make it makes it easier for us on a later assault. Um, friendly unit composition. Obviously, we have myself as 1-6 for hammer. Uh, Lane is my platoon sergeant. Uh, Harrison Smith is the squad leader. Uh, mortar, uh, striker team, mortars is Garrett and Richard. Uh, Basilisk is Matt and Tommy. They are the uh, MI8 with the gun pods. And then Dagger is Dan, Steve, and Devin. Devin also is the one with the medical um, bag. Uh, they are the one with the six fucking rocket pods. So lots of boom boom on that one. Does anybody have any questions? I know I went over that super quick. Uh, so if you have questions, speak now. What do you want the RPG team to go by on comms, assuming we're separated? Um, do you have a name in mind? Because they're, they're, they're just going to be a... They're, they're, they're technically part of the main squad. Right, no, um, fuck it, we're good. Okay. Uh, just to confirm, are we using um, Basilic or Dagger as our uh, respawn helicopter? It, whatever is available, but um, Dagger is the one with the medic. Got it. So they should primarily be used. Yeah. Okay. Any other questions? Um, in the case uh, we're to take cross, um, but then face heavy resistance, like, for example, an Abrams or something heavy like that, we might have a hard time dislodging. Uh, what would we do in that situation? So if, for whatever reason, we are unable to take cross due to heavy armor, um, we are just going to fall back up the hill. The armor cannot follow us through the, tr through the woods. Uh, and then we're going to reassault on tier bed, take tier bed, and just dig in and hold. Uh, and we're just going to wait for Is the 7th Panzer. Is on cross or no? We, we can. I don't know if an 82, 82 millimeter is going to do anything to an Abrams. The grads are going to be... Uh, the grads are going to be busy hitting other targets, so we don't have grads. Um, we can call for the air support, but uh, once again, I don't know if the rocket pods are going to do anything other than just piss off an Abrams. Unless okay. you're bringing, like, 15 Metis launchers, there is nothing you can do to an Abrams. So, cool. you, you might be able to track it, but, like, that's it. I love being on the other side of America's force dominance. That's what that's what Connor was saying yesterday when we were talking about it. Hell yeah. Yeah. Um, so, if an Abrams is spotted, prior to, uh, smokes are redline, smoke that thing, blind it, get far enough away from it that you can't, that it can't see you anymore um they do have a visual range of about a fucking kilometer so if you get enough trees between you and it uh you'll be fine because it just won't be able to see you anymore well, how are we gonna get them out here? then how do that's we get what, that's the problem for the how seventh. do we deal with them that's a problem for the seventh we are just gonna hold the town they won't be able to man maneuver through the town easily it's, especially do if we, we put enough C4? fucking we can bring some c4 but i don't know if it's gonna do anything for that, abrams don't do that let's get some mines eric if, if there's a position you suspect enemy armor, it is wise to just not go there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll figure so, it out. Okay. I would avoid objective cross if you suspect armor is there at all. We 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 can it, we can avoid cross if that's what command wants us to do, and just hit that um, PB, well, or think, we can just I focus we entirely on your bed, and, and then, then we, we hit it if we think we can take it. Okay, cross is literally just like a. Like I said, it, it's literally just a crossroads in the middle of a field. Yeah. There's there's nothing defensible about it. But, it's just a key point for bringing. Yeah, well, that means it'll be that means yeah. it'll be easy to recon. Yeah. Cool. All right. I mean, you yeah, saw how yeah. close I, how close those pictures were taken. Like I was able to, on that one slide, I was able to read the fucking yeah, e name enough. of well, the tank. Yeah, yeah well, it's we'll called the uh, Mississippi Queen. If anyone was interested. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yep. So how, I'm, how close I got to it. I'll chime in from this. For this. From, sure, yeah, go ahead, come in. from the company level here, there's nothing we need that crossroads for right now. We need that crossroads in like a week once we've got our beachhead and need to get supply trucks out there. If you want to push an LPOP out there, that's awesome, but you don't need your whole squad there. And if you suspect enemy armors there, pushing your squad out there with nothing to kill the Abrams with is just a waste of time, and you're going to die. So... Right, I don't think up there is great. Raid on tier but you don't need to go up there. So do you guys, so you think then focus entirely on tier bad and it is hit it from the a, north? If you see a tactical advantage to seizing cross with your squad, you go for it. You're in charge. But from my perspective, I don't see that. Okay. Then then we can just focus entirely on tier bad. So 
original phase plan was going to be tier bed cross um, instead of cross tier bed. Um, so we'll just go with that. Um, just move straight south from primary LZ and hit tier bed. Um, there's enough tree line. It is fresh growth as you get closer to tier bed, um, according to our recon teams. Um, but there is still enough cover to get in there and get right up on the edge of town before that northern bunker by the gas station um, can really spot anybody. Okay, um, then if we're looking at that, I would suggest maybe to the north we establish a support by fire position, and then we send a group to swing around and make the assault. Swing around which direction? The west so side thinking, of your bed uh, is an open the, field. So around grid uh, 041075, you see right at that grid line intersection. Oh, I got to pull up my map. Yeah, uh, if we it. can set a support by fire in that northeastern portion of Tirabad, then if we can just send a group around the fuel depot to wipe out those trenches to the west and then just head south right into Tirabad. That is open field for like a good half kilometer. It's open field from the main road to the dirt road. There is no cover. It is like farmland. Okay, so you can't get to the buildings near the uh, fuel depot then? You could from that like northeast section of the grid square. It's like woods on the what on the eastern side, open field on the left. Okay, well I think if we establish uh, if we can establish support by fire, that might support you guys to move. But uh, and but then we can just the... figure it out from there. Yeah, yeah. honestly, we 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 got to get eyes on. Cross could be completely okay. Open. Yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just figure out a best support by fire position when we get there, and then we'll send a uh, flanking element. To fire yeah. Cool. All right. Uh, if anybody needs to go finalize kits, grab redline items, go do that now. Bring e tools, bring smokes, um, get whatever you guys need. Um, we will go from there. All right. Yeah. So uh, you guys are a part of a country spanning invasion here you're one small cog in the machine this is a classic sort of airborne operation where you are dropping in i'm mostly blind but you did have some good recon thanks to peter but you're dropping in you're going to seize this key crossroads and you're just going to wait till the armor comes and picks you up and relieves you and that's pretty much all we can tell you uh we're not going to have any real artillery or indirect fire support as they're going to be occupied elsewhere especially as we try and get the armor pushing in from the north and west uh those north and west highways uh we suspect there might be a lot of roadblocks out there uh nato armor etc so all of our indirect fire support is mostly going to be targeted out that way um but yeah you guys need to hold that town uh and then defend it from any kind of counterattack until the seventh panzer division shows up that's about all we got all right um I want the infantry squad. I'm standing under the East German flag in front of the helicopters. I want them to round up here. All right. If, if you guys are good and set, no more questions, uh, go to your respective Discord channels. Infantry guys, we are switching to in-game chat. So mute and deafen yourself yeah. on. All right. Muted. Ah, so much quieter. RPG team, best RPG team. Yeah, Garrett, I'm in the Discord channel. Hi. Hey, Devin, if you want to get out of that nice stance. Red bandanas. I don't know if you heard about this. Red bandanas. I don't know. It's really good. Yeah, are you, are you okay there? Sorry, I had to switch in Discord. Oh, okay, that's fine. Somebody else I thought was using it. Okay. Blaze. Somebody's going to be wearing black. 
uh, platoon radio is going to be um, 42. I'm going to go talk to the flight crews and let them know. And then we'll, um, we should be ready to go in about eight minutes. I already missed doing artillery. Uh, so what I got, <laughs> I got the RPG team. Again, I'd love to have those guys, uh, the F-19s, with like autonomy. some line of sight, uh, just to see I'm like what the effects of the target is. Too close though. Oh yeah. You don't want sight on artillery. artillery. You're too close. Yeah, I'm not going to use the equation. I'm just using the line. I'm wearing a black armband. Well, it is mortars, so it is a less, little bit less accurate. Yeah, but I think it, I think it's run the same way as the artillery, where it is super accurate. So we're going to have to wear a black armband with white stripes on it. I saw six shots in the same spot, and they got like a 25 to 50 meter spread. Oh, well, then that's so perfect. That's, that's what I was saying. Wearing, it's going to be uh, way easier to do saturation. Black. The only downside yeah, I found was that like when I was walking, I the there'd yeah, be some times where there'd be like a big gap the because one would go no, left it, and one it, would go it, right. It should be because stripes are Yeah, if you have okay. multiple mortars, it's, yeah. I'd rather people look to find you. Yeah. That was an interesting sound. Right. Uh, unfortunately, I could not get the stream working. It kept fucking lagging out. I don't know why. Um, I gotta get my other streaming PC out set up, but Sweet. no stream I today. Things that can be canceled. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah, eh, I'm filming anyway. You guys are fine. Say all the slurs they want. Bro, I'm uh, just saying. Like go yeah. I fucking oh, hate go okay, and their uh, rules. Tyler, uh, put on a white <laughs> armband if you're running with mortar. All right. Okay. Oh, cool. Oh, we have another mortar. I've been lost uh, in the fucking sauce for forty minutes. How many beers is everybody at? I know what you're good. Mortar's over. Mortar's over here. I am on number three. I've also been cracking through right now with Benjamin Franklin. Ooh, fun. Okay. Also, if you're gonna be in mortars, load up your backpack with nothing but am uh, mortar ammo. 
That sounds like a wonderful idea, actually. How much time do I have to step off? Because I will just bring the bar to my room. We have uh, three minutes officially. Um, basically, whenever the uh, fucking heli crews will yell at us to get in there. Which one? 80, uh, 82 or the uh, the larger one? Nah, it should be the six round 82. Yep. Uh, oh, and then also when you get a chance, jump into our Discord. We've got one specific for mortars. Okay. Alright. Uh, mortars. Who else is joining mortars? Uh, what's your name again? He's got to jump in our Discord. Yeah, hey, when you get a second, jump in our Discord. Um, there's one specifically for mortars. All right, we are going to be in Dagger, the Dagger helicopter. Gotcha. I am excited to serve the Netherlands. So half the, half the crew should get in one, half the crew should get in the other. Well, I've got Discord open on the uh, on the other monitor. Which uh, which channel and which uh, which one are you guys actually in? Uh, there should be one Erdenink Ur for one. That's mortars. Should yes, be a sub uh, voice channel. Lost one guy. Well, he says he's trying to get. I don't know why he's having difficulty, but he says he's going. He has to split open. Hey, but we're going to get into the chopper now. We can figure this out later. Okay, gotcha. Garrett, which chopper are you in? The tan or the green? Uh. 1 6, this is 1 7. I think I got in the tan one. Because uh, all, all the, inf all uh, the infantry the tan on guy. helicopter is good to go. Uh, waiting on yep, one person in rear. I have mortar team and one other, I think, person with me in the rear helicopter. Rear infantry. Infantry in my chopper, the rear chopper. Do we have everyone on? Like one person. I believe total. so. <laughs> good, good no, I have, I have the mortar team and plus one uh, as well as myself. So I got three additional guys in here. You guys know your flight path? No. Because this is not the, the flight path. Seat. Holy shit. Or wherever they're going. Can, hey, can you just chill the fuck out for one second, Pete? Thank you. No. <laughs> not everyone was terminally online. I'm waiting on, on Steve. Hold on. Okay. Why not, Lutz? Actually, I'm going to go switch seats and close the door. Hold on. Oh, third uh, person, third mortar person. What's your name? Who is it? Uh, Tyler. Which, oh. so, you're a, you guys said you had a mortar channel? In, in which yeah. Discord? Oh, Reforger. They're, they're Udernik. Uh, yeah, they're Udernik. Are you in the Reforger channel? I the don't Reforger think I with am. the boys? I'm, I don't think I'm he is. Ass magic and, and, okay, uh, stand by. Okay. I'll send you, I'll send you the link. Uh, oh, are you in the, are you in the chat? Hop in one of the chats. I will send you a link to Reforger uh, in Ass Magic. I'll just, just any channel, and I'll send you one. Okay, yeah, I was just assuming you went to Reforger, and I guess that's why it was confusing. <laughs> Are you in any? Uh, hop in any voice chat in uh, Ass Magic. Who are you in Ass Magic? What's your name? Uh, should be the same. Should just be uh, should be bags of old. Okay, stand with, by. Uh, Tyler at the end. Found it. Sent. And then yeah, in that one there'll be a voice channel for Ed. There'll be a voice channel for Ed in that one. Oh. Oh. <laughs>
And by securing that, I mean shelling the fuck out of it. Sorry, I'm doing math. <laughs> no, you're good. I'm, I'm trying to get our references squared away. Remember, when we get out of this helicopter, you only get on the left side. So I will head forward. Everybody else uh, head out counterclockwise of me. Uh, I will get out first. So you mean white? Doors opening. Stand by. Get the fuck out of my bird. I'm just the ah! Ah! <laughs> Was I gonna get taken out by the rocket pods? One six is on the ground. Go go go! You get the goods. Yep. All right, hit that target. We have to build the mortars though, don't we? Yeah. Pete, where the hell is the mortar stuff? It's up ahead, so... Get out of the open ground, get out of the ground. Stand by. We are not spirit! Okay. <laughs> Alright, where the fuck is Lane? Alright. Uh, get your guys up to that tree line, clear this, uh, fucking ruined town. I need a, a compass direction. I got you. South. <laughs> Just, uh, move south to the tree line. I'll, I'll get you guys where we need to go. Uh, alright. Lane, where? Here it is. Fuck yeah, let's go. 1-6, this is 1-7. I'm just going through the rubble right now, so I'm not walking through an open field. Just Copy. I will. I'm um, heading towards the uh, farming collective sign on the edge of the tree line through the rubble. I'll meet you at the greenhouse. Squad lead. Rockets are going to the tree line. Where did you go, Richard? I'm just oh, moving. I found you. Oh, I found yeah. you guys. Hold yeah. on. All right, let's let's keep going. Tyler, are you in the Discord yet? Uh, yeah, should be in the Discord. Oh, one, six to one, okay, one, never mind. I just didn't hear you for a second. Yeah, so, in the tree line when you guys cool, get there. Cool. No, no, you're uh, good. Figure okay. out where to set up mortars. Right. I'm trying to, sorry, yeah. I've been sitting here with for like the last 40 minutes with my thumb up my ass because I was just like, oh, okay. And I hear Eric talking and shit popping up on the map. And I was like, oh, fuck, I am missing the briefing. <laughs> it's okay, we'll mortar. Most of that doesn't apply to us. All right, we're pretty much going to be hanging back. Yeah. As they advance, and then once we found our find our spot, okay, if that's our LZ. Oh shit! I need to redraw my fucking map. God damn it! Okay. I don't know if dropping us off in the middle of an open field was a good idea. To be honest, it's the only way you get a helicopter. One, six, two, striker. Yeah, I suppose it's true. Uh, striker, uh, striker or this is striker, striker, striker sent traffic over. Hey guys. I'm right in front of you guys. Hey Hold guys. on. There we go. Okay. All right, uh, Garrett, follow me. We're gonna walk you guys to your uh, base management tent. Let me get set up mortars. What's up? Harrison, you got me on 39. I'm here, bro. You want it set up um, right where the 10 is? Alright. Uh, Garrett, do you know how to use the um, base management stuff? I am going to have to very quickly figure it you out. You need me to set up mortars for you. Uh, uh, Garrett, I know how to do it. Okay. Okay. So, base management table here. This building behind it is full of supplies. You got um, me on comms. So, you go in here. You go over to the um, little, like, Rubik's Cube icon. Mm -hmm. um, and the Podnos mortars are on page three. 
Yep, you will yep. then select those, place them wherever inside the giant ass white circle, and then you have to use your E tool to construct them. Yep, I got it. Uh, oh, Garrett? Uh, feel free so, to yeah. dig um, trenches first or set up sandbags as well. If you want additional guys to help you dig uh, mortar emplacements, I can send some guys back. We're good. I, I do not see where the mortars are. Yeah. If you want, uh, uh, Garrett, you can stand in the spot where you want the uh, mortars to go, and I'll... Have a Discord channel with him, so let me know what he's saying. Oop, almost. Yeah, I got him. Sorry. Sorry. No, yeah, I got done. it. Okay. Um, do you want uh, me to send additional infantry back to help dig mortar pits and set up trenches and sandbags? Uh, we've, we got three people. We should be fine. Okay. All right. Um, this is... You guys have pretty much, like, another 150 meters out into the field to, like, set up stuff. Um, you guys have, like, a pretty big radius here because this is a big supply depot. Set them up wherever you guys want so that they clear the trees tops. Um, you guys should be good to go. Um, radio me if you need anything. All right, get, okay. uh, stand where right, you want lane, me to put go. them. Uh, 16211. Okay. So, so we, since we have to be able to clear the trees, go ahead, one six. probably... Oh, I kind of um, want to keep uh, close you, to the tree line. and you 17 are done the helping tree. mortars set up. Uh, mortars should be set up within the next five minutes. Uh, we are, mm. I see the rest of the squad. We are coming back to you guys. The the thing is, Understood we over. might as well just leave them here. Because if we clear out the trees, then it's just going to point a spot pretty much to us. Fair enough. Like, we, we own this area. We might as well just use it. Yeah. Plus, we have to, I think, keep it close to the building supplies so we can keep them stocked with ammo. Well, we could also just run ammo. Again, we can carry eight rounds of... We can carry 48 at a time. I can't, because I have the radio. Right, but I'm saying there's one person could fill them up real quickly. That's true. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just... <laughs> That's the saying. If you want to stand... I don't want to... I'm trying to figure out... Are we still at the primary LZ? Like, oh wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, he's got the mortar pit location on the map. So, just set us up right here. Like, but, it's not rocket science. So, but you want him close to the tent? Yeah, let's let's keep him kind of. You, do you see where I'm at? Yeah, I by the trees there. I see you. So one can go. Yeah. There. Although, Boop. let me see. Let's see elevation. If we're at a thousand, two hundred. Ooh. Okay. I can also just move things uh, as well before the bill. Yeah, I, I think probably right here and just go like across following the tree line is probably our best bet. In a line. True. How yeah, um just straight in a line. Yeah. What's the lowest elevation? What shit does that point at? Because I feel like we're gonna be uh, pretty low trees right here. Lowest lowest elevation gets us fifteen hundred meters. Okay. Yeah. Uh what spacing do you want for the motors? Uh like 10 to 15 meters. Okay. You should see wooden posts in the ground. And if you pull it to each I do. you should see the outlines of the plans placement. Oh, I'm so glad the game spawned me without a fucking e-tool. Oh, shit. <laughs> Did it really not? Oh, okay. It, oh, my fucking God. I uh, Hang on a second. If I build an arsenal, which we use to be... We supply these guys anyway. Yeah, I think if you can get, if you're able to put an arsenal down real quick, just so I can get an E tool, and then uh, well, we need them to resupply the mortar, so. Okay. You might, as well, yeah, just do it anyway. Yeah. All right, that's down. I'll build that guy real quick so that you can help us with that. Nope, nope, nope. Did not want to. All do right, that's that. that's the first one. I'm going to at least get the mortars up because I have a feeling they're probably going to need the support here fairly soon. Yeah, makes sense. Where'd you guys put that uh, that box at? Uh, it's not going to be a box. It's going to be a whole little ammo dump. I'm still building it. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I was looking for the little, uh, just nah, the little box. The, well, and it, technically it is a little box, but the arsenal is an ammo depot and that comes with the... They split it up into gear and guns when you build okay. it. Okay. Um, that reminds me. We should probably build sandbags. Yep, I can do that once we get these. Yes. Guys, but... All right, arsenal's up. Okay. Okay. Um, question about the mortars. I don't know if you guys have used it before. Um, yeah. How, 
in depth am I about to have to get into this? Oh no, like, super. You've got two things: elevation and right. azimuth, which is directional facing. Okay, so that's uh, it. Super. Well, Forger is a lot more simplified than Arma Three. Okay, well, because like I used to do mortars, so I was. Oh. That's yeah. So I was curious if I needed okay. to pull out like fucking charge charts and all that fun shit. No, no, no. I'm so charge. glad. We... <laughs> yeah, no charge. Armor three, you'd have a lot more of that, but no charges or one charge. Oh, okay. Yeah. Also, um, Garrett, if you have your E tool out, you can activate placing and make dirt mounds as well as sandbags. Well, the the question will be, how do I do that on? Oh, Xbox. I have no idea. Oh, here we go. Start building. Here we go. Yeah. So I'm gonna we'll put some sandbags, but you can just add a drop of a hat. And you can make those whenever. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try and at least get us stuff kind of placed in front and do the sides. Then I'm making sand bay. They've got these like whole little tree craft thingies you have to use, but I'll put those outside the dirt piles to give us actual height um, from like fire and whatnot. Alright, we don't need to go crazy with the structures, okay? Hmm. <laughs> so That's you're saying you to... don't need to build a stage three mortar pit? <laughs> Oh, I didn't even think to dig first. <laughs> oh, well. Wait, you can dig? It's... Yeah, normally mortars are in a pit. They're low to the ground. Oh, but I don't think the Forger gives us that option. Oh, well, that's okay. Yeah. As long as we have some level of fortification, we'll be okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I would like love I'm if you actually dig pits. But the trenches are usually making the walls, and that's a trench as opposed to building down, unfortunately. Yeah. Well, and again, I don't want to tax the server too much either. Okay. Because once we get down into the once we get down into the town, we're gonna have to build more shit too. That's a good point. I'm actually gonna delete these. I just found individual sandbag thingies. So I'm gonna build those instead. Yeah. Okay. So okay. D again, don't get crazy because yeah. I want to start. Well, that's what I'm saying. That's why I'm making bin. these really small ones. Okay. This, this is striker, striker sent traffic, traffic over. over. Roger that, that striker, striker will, will comply. comply over. All right. Uh, let's see. So, oop, stop. There we go. Okay. So first, first direction is going to be one nine one azimuth. Pushing. One nine one azimuth, and then let's see elevation. Let's see if I did if I counted my grid squares right <laughs> we should be at 1,000 meters so elevation is going to be two zero zero on the dot uh, gun lay all right gun set all right I will radio in that we are ready to begin fire mission stand by for you know, the thing. Mm -hmm. Roger that. that. We, we have, have not encountered anybody yet. Over. Uh, by the way, or I'm sorry, break. We, we are, are ready, ready to begin, begin our uh, initial, initial bombardment, bombardment of uh, Trinidad. Trinidad. Over. Just, uh, just, just let us know when you're ready to receive fire. Over. Roger that. Awaiting further orders. Okay. So there are civilians in the area. Um, there is a dirt road to the southeast. 
Yes. Um, we so we may encounter civilians. Uh, they ignored the initial Soviet move, uh, but for us, um, so we're waiting on call for fire right now. If you want to keep building stuff, Tyler, yeah. that's cool. Okay. I'm also gonna load you guys in with my extra shells, so we should all have like four to five. Okay. Yeah, I'm I'm just staying on the gun in case they call it like right quick. No, I get you. Do you want us to have these guns dispersed out? Not not like dispersed out, but have slightly different data inputs to get a spread fire. Oh my god! That's a busy attention. <laughs> uh, no, only because there's like it'll the mortars will automatically do it. Sweet. Okay, dude, that takes so much awesome. Okay. Yeah, I was just like on one hand, yeah, they're inaccurate. On the other hand, we. The, what was it, the one, M119s we had to do, because they were super talking accurate. For a sec. I'm talking for a sec. Uh, this is a striker. We did see aircraft flying overhead. They may have spotted us. Probably no. spotted us. Yeah. Right. So, Striker might be hiding in the um, I think our best bet is maybe we ought to scout the wilderness because we may have to move the mortars. Copy. They, I mean, they may come and attack, so jump into the woods quick. That'll also avoid their uh, their fire too. They seem to be focusing fire to the. 45, 16. Well, right. just hang tight for a minute. I'm uh, just gonna kind of. Guess like, so I can move we don't trees need... to make a clearing if we want to. You know that might not be a terrible thing. We may have to relocate the mortars then. All right. But at least at least we're set up right now that if we can provide fire, then we're okay. Yeah. I'm gonna radio back in that we're still okay, uh, but we are gonna have to reposition the mortars to get a better. Um, We'll probably have to spread them out, too. Yeah. That makes sense. A, no, that makes perfect sense. Are we are we expecting a counter battery at some point? Possibly. Okay. Uh, it Probably after we take the town, but we're probably going to have to relocate into the town. Okay, gotcha. Depending. Um, but for right now, we just got to worry about the air cover. Uh, Richard, honestly, stick a mortar right here. All right, hang right on where second. I'm standing. I gotta get to the little. Because this is, this is actually pretty clear. All right, hang on. Let me. Yeah, right where you're standing, because our OBJ is directly like south, pretty much. Okay, I'm gonna take out these first three trees right here. That should give us enough uh, overhang. Okay. Hang uh, on, placing at your standing. I don't okay. see the. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah. Let's say I don't see the sticks. All right. <laughs> yeah, I, I appreciate the out. sticks are like you know, <laughs> construction zone. Um, we can also make camouflage netting. I don't want to do that because we have to have overhead clearance. I was about to say I don't know if the mortars would shoot through that. From personal experience, they you don't want you don't want it. <laughs> no, I understand. That, that makes sense. <laughs> if whenever you're firing them, you want them removed whenever you're firing it. But like if you were trying to conceal, yes. But that we would have to take it down. Yeah, as soon as yeah I get you. All right, hold on. Hammer, this, this is striker. Do you read over? One six. six. This, this is Striker. Do you read over? Go for hammer. Uh, uh, we, are we are going, going to have to reposition, reposition the mortars into the tree line, line uh, but, but we, we do have them set up. Ready for fire mission. We are 
Code ready for fire mission, stand by. All right. They are ready for fire mission, so we'll stick with the same uh, azimuth. We're going to adjust elevation. All right. um, Striker, we are good for fire mission on OBJ Cross. Do you need a grid square, or are you able to figure that out on your own? <laughs> oh, they're doing OBJ Cross. Okay. Uh, negative, I believe I will have that zeroed here in a second. Do you want me to begin fire mission as soon as I'm ready? Yes, you are uh, clear for fire mission whenever you guys get them set up. Roger, Roger that. Stand, stand by, by for shots. shots. Okay. Uh, let's see, let me do some math quick. One, two, three, four. Uh, can we get an estimate on rounds count? Uh, for this, for this first one, one I'll give you a, a ten. ten. Over. Uh, we have to reload after six. I, I under, it five per. Oh, quarter. okay. Yeah. Remember. Sorry, that math thing so, again. This is, well, so this is why fire direct and center is important because um, you guys are only listening to half the conversation. Remember that. Okay, so OBJ cross is azimuth at 154. Azimuth 154. Elevation is going to be, let's see here. Uh, we're going to do two, I'm sorry, one, nine, zero. So one, nine, zero elevation. Do we have any air elements in the AO right Gun now? Laid. What was the azimuth? One, five, four. Yeah. One, one, five, four. All right. Got up. All right. Let me get mine set up. One, five, four. Okay, so um, Tyler, give me one round. I'm going to send shot out uh, for sighting, and then we'll see if we have to make an adjustment. All right, firing. Yep. It's so... Did you shoot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's nice so and quiet. quiet. <laughs> God, it sounded so weak. Rounds complete. Yeah, because the last time we had a fucking cannon. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Hammer this striker. striker. I have one, one sighting round. round sent out. out. Let, Let me know where, know where it hits. Over. over. Oh, I should have my stopwatch up. This thing takes like 30 seconds to. Yeah, it takes fucking forever. I mean, that's. We did not send a forward observer up for um standby. <laughs> Roger. <laughs> they didn't send a forward observer. Come on, guys. <laughs> Just blow something up, and we'll see if it happens. Yeah, you should have splashed in about 10, 15 seconds. Yeah, I'm gonna get my stopwatch going because may have to may have to send another round, but that's okay. Yeah, because no one's looking at it. I mean, dude, to be completely honest, it is incredibly accurate to real life. If is you're it really like, thirty seconds? Yeah. Or something? Oh fuck yeah! Oh yeah! God damn! Oh yeah, we yeah, Richard, we were looking at this the other night. I was like, holy shit, that's incredibly long. Yeah, the artillery can be like five minutes. Yeah, it's, but it's, I assume that's when they're shooting, like, you know, half a mile. Uh, artillery can shoot multiple miles. Oh. Yeah. Um, like a 105 howitzer can hit, like, 17, 18 miles. <laughs> yeah, your uh, you're, you're 120 has a maximum effective range of 7,200 meters, give or take. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Is that what you did? You did it in the Army or the Marines? No, it was, uh, it was Army. So I was the... Uh, I did all of it, but I spent most of my time with the uh, with the gun line uh, with the 60. Okay, the little guy. Yeah, so yeah, most of the time you would um, we would be just doing direct lay, so you wouldn't have to. Have it would just be uh, just fucking use your thumb, aim, have fun. <laughs> use your yeah. thumb. Hammer the striker. Do I need to send another shell over? Oh dear. Huh, I hear an airway title. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 cause Trinidad is a forward operating base for the UK. Oh. So they oh, probably yeah. did that too. So I will say this though, if I tell you guys to stop talking or to shut up, 
just immediately stop because I have radio traffic in on the main comms. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It was one two zero to cross. One two zero to cross. What? One two zero? There's no way. Uh, say, say again. again. Hammer. Hammer over. Stand by. We're um. Forward observer's got a little turned around. Oh. Roger, Roger that. Okay, he was he wasn't talking to us. Helicopter. All right. Um. Yeah. Make sure we identify what helicopters are coming. Finally. In. That that's ours. Okay. Yeah. That's I just heard it and I was like. And there's the other one. God they bless probably, them. You know, they, I miss artillery though. Oh, like the actual cannons and the. Oh yeah, because like it has destructive power. Yeah. Oh yeah. Like we could probably have dealt something to the Abrams. Yeah. Assuming it was stationary but, enough or whatever. Well, <laughs> see, that's that is the thing with the artillery is the artillery is super accurate, so you have to like wiggle to be like yeah. you have to wiggle it within a whatever. But we did a pretty solid job last time. Well, and again, the first two spots we hit, the first two targets, we obliterated. Yes. It was that third one that was giving us trouble. Well, it's because it was so close mm. Mm -hmm. that I was trying to overcorrect too far. Well, that and we Should also not. had on, like, the elevation changes were ridiculous in Afghanistan maps. Uh, and Abrams, 1-1-2 uh, one, one, striker. Sorry, not 1-1, one, 1-6 one, one, to striker. Send traffic, hammer. hammer. Uh, Abrams have been spotted on cross. We are not going to hit cross at this time. We're going to focus on tier bed. Uh, a enemy artillery position has been seen uh, to the east, oh, sorry, west of tier bed. I've marked the approximate location on uh, the map. Uh, I do not have a full grid square for you yet, though. Roger that. Would, Would you want us to start uh, uh, hitting tier bed, bed, or do you want, want us to, to focus on artillery first? Focus on tier bed. We'll get eyes on for you and help you walk shots in on that uh, radar station. Uh, that should help uh, with getting more air support in the area. Roger that. We're we going to begin, begin fire, mission fire mission on tier on bed. Tier bed. Over. Over. Okay, so tier bed is azimuth 191. Come on. And elevation is going to be 200. Zero, zero. All right. Gun up. Uh, gun laid. Gun up. Uh, let's go five rounds per gun. Fire when ready. Fire. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. Should be about 15 seconds to splash. Make sure you reload. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Five we seconds. may have just have to. We may just have to like continuously hammer it, but. That's um, fine. <laughs> I don't mind blowing it is things up. Hammers. This is striker. We have, we have sent, sent a volley. Let, let me know where it is. Over. Based on my protractor, we <laughs> should be okay. It's nice because you don't have wind or anything else to move those rounds around. And that might be wind. I don't know. <coughs> I guess not because the other utility would have moved. Bless you. Thank you. Shouldn't have to worry about wind too much with the uh, with 81s and 82s and 120s. Unless we're getting like super far out there. I guess that's true. Now the helicopter... Uh, both friendlies left already. Might be the attack chopper though. Uh, no! Way. That is not friendly. That is an enemy Apache. Yeah. It has not spotted us though. Yeah, it's probably like it's going after the... Alright, with the fire mission still actively going. Let's continue to move stuff into the trees. Gotcha.
and then uh, set up a decent defensible position. Uh, do we want these guys on a line again or on a triangle? Stop talking. Observers, Observers striker, send, send your traffic, traffic again, again over. over. Roger that. All right. Okay, Tyler, you're on the gun right now, right? Correct. Okay, go ahead and send um, 10 rounds. Same grid and azimuth. Okay. Fire when ready. Observer, this is Striker. We have rounds going out uh, approximately 30 seconds until they impact. Over. Do you want me to send the other five? Yes, send all 10. Okay. Richard's working on building stuff, and I'm trying to also build stuff. Yeah, uh, get. I've got them in a line so the third one's in the white of Tyler. Okay. Uh, right. And then I'll make. Round complete. Uh, Striker, if you've been sending rounds, correct to your right about 50 meters. Ooh, okay. 50 meters. 50 meters to the right? Uh, yeah. Uh, when, when you, you say, say 50, 50 meters, meters to the right, right do you mean north, north south, south, east, east or west? west over. Over. I think he died on the kill cam. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even look to see. That's happened before with Eric. Okay. Um. If he said 50 meters to the right. I'm suspecting it's going to be to the west, since we're facing south. Um. So, hold on. Let me finish. Oh shit. Okay. Hold on. Pulled up my map again. So 50 meters. Uh, new at Smith is going to be one, nine, three. One, yeah. six to launch your crew. Just stand by. All right. It's it's late on one, nine, three. OK. Disassemble our other mortars. Yeah, I'll get to that at some point. Okay. Once I finish He's working on. Yeah, once I finish placing these things, I'll work because you can't get rid of them from the building. You have to manually. Okay. Oh, you have to do it with the E tool. Yeah, because I okay. guess they don't want you to be like, oh, it's just it's not it's not an RTS, you know, you can't. It's not a city builder. Okay. You're so right. Two guns laid on one nine three. Uh, I'm gonna go set up. Uh, the other guns are uh, the same one. Okay. Well, just stick with the ones in the trees. Yeah. And then um, when Richard's done kind of positioning stuff, he'll start disassembling stuff. I'm yep. building up our, like, wall fortification right now. Okay. So um, I, would just, I just want you to just stay on the gun, to be honest. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, sandbags are placed. Uh, actually, no, hang on, this is a Okay. Alrighty, I'll get back to the. So, you. At Sorry. some point, I'll take uh, some trees down and move the arsenal inside so it's not just another target. Uh, I'm gonna call out to Peter here in a second. Copy. One six, this is striker. Over. They might be a little preoccupied. It's possible. Uh, yeah, so. <laughs> they might not be having the best of times right now. 
Yeah, I, I mean, also might just be half tempted to just send it. Yeah. To be honest. I don't think again, this is not heavy artillery and would not in the town, so it's kind of like. All right, Tyler, get on the gun. I, I'm coming to my Doing... other gun. Oh yeah, that's right. You're done. Yep, yep. I'm just building slash just. Okay. Sort of them. Yep. Get on the gun. On gun. Okay, so he said adjust right. So, Tyler, you're at one nine four azimuth. Okay. Or I'm sorry. Did you say one nine? What were you set to? Um, I was originally one nine one. We adjusted to one nine three. Same elevation. Yeah. Yeah. Adjust to one nine four. Okay. It's gone up. Uh, same elevation. So one nine four azimuth. Uh. Finally, right, helicopter probably... landing in the field. Okay. Okay. Oh, God. All right. Uh, Richard, are you on the gun? Yep. Okay. Tyler, you're on the gun. Yep. So we'll go over this one more time. Azimuth is one nine four. Copy. Azimuth one nine four. Elevation two zero zero. Copy. Shit, are we getting attacked? I don't know. They dropped some friendlies down, and then there was some shots fired. Might have been okay, an ND. Whatever. Uh, let's go. Ten rounds per gun. Fire when ready. Fire. Six down, reloading. Eric's back up, or he's in the vicinity. Yeah, I think that was... I think he did die, and that was him who just got dropped off. <laughs> okay. Alright, last four going out. Alright, round complete. Round's complete. Armor the striker, we have sent rounds at new coordinates. Over. Now I am rounds complete. Okay, I was about to ask, like, who's shooting still? <laughs> yeah, well, I. I decided to just get on the gun because I looked around and I was like, okay, most of the fortifications are in place. Okay, That's really I'm weird. just going to do a quick walkthrough. Yeah, there's still a couple of them. I'm also not sure if I can disassemble the mortars. I didn't see an option. I'll have to go back in the building thing and see if I can do from there. Yeah, or might not be. Okay, so I don't know if that's either a glitch or I'm operating the system wrong. Um, in the theoretical mag. Yeah, there... it's a glitch. Because okay. you have more in the inventory, it, it picks like the highest one. Huh. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know why. No, that, that's don't question fine. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't question it. That's, that's okay. all I'm just doing I'm just, it. I'm just wondering why I reloaded and there's still one round in the uh <laughs> yeah. for that mag. So yeah. I'm gonna go get more um one six two striker. Yeah. This is striker, striker send traffic, traffic over. over. Uh requesting a new fire mission for grid square zero four zero zero seven six, the enemy command post. Seven six zero four. That radar zero? dish is still up, uh, I needed it gone so we can get air assets back in the area. Roger that. that. Uh zero four zero and zero seven six, correct? Zero four zero zero seven three. Sorry, zero four zero zero seven three. The uh, building to the left of the crossroads, south of the gas station. Roger that. Stand, stand, stand by, by for, for fire, fire mission. mission. All right, get on the guns. Get it on the guns. Oh, Tyle. By the way, an easy way to access inventories is if you hit tab, it'll show all inventories near you. Oh, okay. Standing by. Okay, so Azmuth is gonna be the Ascending, same. Uh, observers up. 
Um, see so if you saw, shot a spacing one, it might not be seen yet. Roger that. We're getting set up still. Okay, so it's going to be slightly further than where we were aiming at. He says he wants that destroyed, so we're going to do our best. Uh, azimuth, 196. Elevation is going to be 170. I'm sorry, one, yeah, 160. Gotcha. Confirming 195 azimuth, 160 elevation. Affirmative. Gun set. What is set? Yep, gun up. All right, uh, let's do three rounds per gun. Fire when ready. Fire. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. Hammer, this is Straker. We have rounds out approximately 30 seconds until impact. Over. I wish it operated on the same system as grenades. To be completely honest with you, in the system of what? Instead of uh, the system of boxes, just because it, what it seems like is if you don't expend the entire mag, <laughs> then um, you're stuck with uh, three rounds. Like if you, we just did the three round. Oh, fire but there should be a packing okay. mechanism where if you drag half used magazines on top of each other, they fill up. Oh. That was a, oh, so, and also this is a mod, so that's probably why. The person who made the mod yeah. didn't want to add an animation to dropping the rounds in, so they treated it like a gun with a magazine. <laughs> you know, that's that's fair. Okay, it's whatever. Yeah, but I, I get what you're saying. It is weird because, especially with mortars, more than anything, you're used to dropping a round in and it shoots out. I gotta need to set my stopwatch. All right, I have a stopwatch going. Right, because it's like. It's such a long hang time, you know, you can't guess it, like, in your this head. Is why I like the this is why I like the artillery much more, because it was like a 10-second yeah. flight time tops. Well, you know, if we made these mortar barrels, you know, three times as long, maybe right, they go they faster. should be impacting. They should have impacted by now. Yeah. Hammer, this is Striker. Do you have eyes on rounds over? I have to send it again. I know what building he's talking about. Yeah, because of the photos and whatnot. We might be off grid though. Because I we might moved? have estimated. Yeah, it might have been. Uh, set azimuth to. I'm sorry. Yeah. Set azimuth to 194. Wow. And go back to 200. Set. Come up. Stand by. Hammer, this is Striker. I'm sending, sending another, another volley out, out over. over. All right, let's do we another three rounds. In the Oop, stand by. Eastern side of town, so try to focus fire only on the western side. Nah, do it best. Roger that. Uh, focusing on western side of town. Okay, we are gonna adjust azimuth to 1955. 1955. Done set. Set. Uh, let's do five rounds. Each gun, fire when ready. Fire. Actually, just do six. Just empty the whole magazine. I uh, didn't reload because I wanted to use the rest of it, so I'll yes. send three more in a second. <laughs> I, was, right. I was being cheap, so I didn't want to waste them. <laughs> Jesus Christ, guys. 
I... Rounds fucking complete. That's a first. I didn't want to waste, the, you know, the government's money. It's the Soviet government. Yeah. All right, rounds complete, and I'm reloading with a half mag. Yeah, same. Rounds complete. <laughs> Uh, hammer, hammer, the striker, striker we, we have shots, shots out. I assume regular mortars don't have a magazine, because if one round fails, then it's going to launch other mortar shells just anywhere. They're, it's typically like boxes or crates. Yeah, so, yeah, you'll have a crate of, um, 81s will have a crate of 3, 120s will have a crate of 2, and then I believe crate for 60s was, I think, 6? But they, they're never going to have, like, a magazine, per se, where you actually oh, load fuck. that in. Yeah. No, no, fuck no. You load them in from the top. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's no way you could, I mean, even if you could figure out a way to do a magazine, it seems like a bad idea to have six oh, water shells next to each other or something. No, that's uh, too. Let's fuck. readjust. One nine eight. One nine eight. Set. Same elevation. Fire when ready. How many? Oh, uh, six rounds. Fire. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. Got about 15 seconds to splash. Ish. Ish. Well, well I know. go based on the. I go based on the last round. Oh, okay. Because more than likely. Oh, actually, we might be. We're actually fairly planar to them. Yeah, thankfully this isn't an Afghanistan map where it was elevation all over the place. Oh. Yeah. Hammer, this is striker. We have rounds out, out over. All right. After this, uh, stop putting rounds in. We got friendlies clearing through the town. Roger, Roger that. that. We will uh, suspend fire mission until you give us new grid over. Okay. So they are clearing the town right now. Is that, does that mean that's a bad time to start mortaring it? It, it would be a bad time to start mortaring. <laughs> All right, so what's the, like, oh, combine mags. Oh. There we go. There it's, we go. Yeah, it okay. should be like, what, what was an evil or whatever. We just have to, oh, found a way to assemble the other mortars. How do you, uh, where do you see that option? There's no option. Just click and drag two things on top of each other. Oh shit! Yeah, you got it. Yeah, yeah, you got to go in your thing. That's also mod though. So that's that's... okay. <laughs> Figured it out. It's mods for everything. This this is true. I did see a um, an option for uh, when I typed in mortars for the mods, there was a 60, 60 gun with uh with smoke for uh, Willie Pete, which I thought was pretty fucking cool. Yeah. That's pretty neat. But I did not well, see so, the actual gun mod itself. Yeah. So when we did when we did artillery last time, we had the option for smoke, and yeah. the game master, uh, what they decided to do was do CS gas. So okay. we laid, we put one smoke round out, and that was like their spot to where they put CS gas. Nice. Funny story. They now have, they found another mod to add CS um, underslung grenades and regular hand grenades as CS gas. Oh, that's fucking Jesus. Yeah, it's so much. It's so much shit to manage, though. Yeah, and also the smoke doesn't go away on its own for some reason. <laughs> huh. So like it'll just stay there the entire time until the game master gets rid of it. All right, keep your eyes out in case we get attacked. Yep, yep. I'm out in the field now, disassembling things. Now, granted, we're in the woods. So it's going to be close line of sight. Mm -hmm. Oh, Tyler, you did also miss the uh, briefing in that we were supposed to have the uh, Krinkovs. 
Well, yeah. Actually, go ahead from the, the arsenal. Long. Oh, yeah, yeah. And this is true. Honestly, you probably don't need the optical sight. No. Because we're going to be so cl close range, and the optical sight that he suggested kind of sucks. Well, I mean, oh. yes, it's very Russian. Funny enough, um, I did, when I first jumped in the lobby, I did actually have a crank up. I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> now, by all means, feel free to put RPK mags in the crank up. <laughs> You know, there's no reason you can't have a 45 round tracer mag <laughs> in, your, so, in your shorter rifle. Yeah, I'm gonna disassemble our yep. stuff. Yeah. And of course, like usual, it takes a fucking ever to get rid of all this dirt. Yeah. <laughs> the key thing we have to watch out for, of course, is air. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think they saw us. I mean, even the eight, eight, the the eight ten that was doing gun runs or whatever seemed to be more focused on the helicopters than on land stuff. Probably. I was more worried about that uh, Apache because that thing just yeah, but it just went right past us. Yeah, again, thankfully he didn't see us. We were in the woods by then because that could just hover and obliterate us. I do like that you can help, Bill. Like, it's not just one person. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, all three of us are doing this. It should yeah. not take very long. It's it's slightly faster. Oh, there we go. The fuck was that? I don't know. We've been getting some... It might be just more counter-battery stuff. I've seen some shells go over our heads towards main base every once in a while. Oh, shit. All right. Let's just stick inside the mortar pit for right now. Do we want me to move the arsenal to inside the woods? Yeah. Kind of like where I'm yeah. standing, maybe, even just to get it some trees. I'd would say just put it directly behind. If you can fit it this close. Hmm, good point. Like, directly behind our sandbag spot. Good point. Now, to be fair, it is right... Um, it is right at the tree line. So it might be okay. It might be okay where it is. This this one right here, I would say is probably pretty good just because you have all this other shit. Hammer um, one six. Hammer one six to dagger or basilisk. Uh, if you go to the middle of it, it'll let you build. Also, be careful if you're building. If you're inside an object when it's built, you will be inside that object after it's built. Gotcha. The game does not care. <laughs> many, That's why I moved. Many a life has been lost, trapped behind the arsenal box inside the metal tube. All right, make sure make sure these get disassembled then too, Rich. Yeah, I'm breaking this guy down. Uh, Tyler, let's just stick let's stick with the guns for right yeah. now. Yeah, this guy shouldn't take too long. Honestly, we might just be here the whole fucking time because yeah. if, we, they if we go into the town and they need close mortar support, we're not going to be able to do it. We can't. How close? Can we, how close can we get to ourselves? Well, let me check. Let me check my chart. The shortest range that's listed was. What's seventy-five meters? Forty. Yeah, seventy-five, roughly. That's pretty close. Okay. Yeah, but 75 is practically a whole grid square. I suppose that's true. Alright, now I need to figure out how to delete my... Boom, you're on dirt mound. The other option is we could send rounds at the possible enemy artillery position. I mean, it couldn't hurt, you know, if we got rid of that guy. This is true. We need we need someone to reserve that, though. We can grab that. That is here. true. Hmm, true. I'm going to set my gun that way, though. So, azimuth for that is 210. Two, and range is about the same. 
Uh, at least I think. Hold on. Let me count the grid squares. Ooh, it's actually way less. Uh, elevation would be three, three, two, zero. All right, gun set. But we're not going to hit that until I get orders. Yeah. Why can't we get to live satellite feeds so we can see if we're bouncing? hitting? <laughs> because it's the 80s. <laughs> So listen to Actually, monkey no. in space. Can't Actually, the we would have had we would have had satellites at this point. Uh, <laughs> just hold on, just hold on a sec, guys. Striker to hammer one six. Do you read over? This is Hammer. We're still alive in here. Uh, we are holed up in the two-story restaurant on the south side of town. There is an enemy Bradley outside, and most of the platoon is dead. That is going well. What is, is the, the grid, grid position, position of, of the Bradley? Bradley? Over. That's what that noise is. I was like, okay. I can feel like I can hear it. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see it on the map. That is really fucking close. Okay. Eek. Zero four zero zero seven three on that uh, southern road leading out of town. Uh, it's approximately there. Do you want us to send rounds over? Yes, if anything, it'll keep the infantry off of us uh, while we're waiting for reinforcements. Roger that. Stand by. Okay, new fire mission. Hells yeah. We're going to go 193 azimuth. 193 azimuth. Oh. And elevation is going to be, we're going to go short. So we're going to go uh, elevation at 220. Gun set. Elevation 220. So 193-220. Yep, got up. And we're going to do six rounds again. Everyone ready. Complete. Uh, this is striker to hammer. We have sent rounds uh, to let us know our impact. Approximately 20 seconds. Copy. The Bradley has moved. I've updated the map marker. It is now oh. southwest <laughs> of our position in the wood line. This is why we shouldn't be shooting at all of us. <laughs> <laughs> got wheels. Okay. Um, anyway, just, uh, real quick, can somebody reload my artillery? Yeah. I am out of ammo yes. somehow. Gotcha. Oh. He updated, <laughs> of course, it, it's right on fucking top of them. Just can tell me how close, close my, uh, impacts, impacts are. Over. Can we just hit them? <laughs> this is a point of principle. Talk six, Klanka seven. Go for Klanka. We are currently holed up in the two-story restaurant slash hotel on the south side of town. Um, half of our platoon is down, but we just took out a Bradley. We are still shelling the town with uh, indirect fire at this time. Okay, solid copy. 7th Armored is waiting on you guys, so utilize your air and see if you can pound those buildings. At this time, we are unable to reach air. I think uh, the range is too great. Air is not within range of the backpack radios. Solid copy. Uh, command will reach out to them. Do you have a grid coordinate for a building you want targeted by them? Or just a general gun run to the town? Uh, if we could do a gun run along the 073 uh, latitude uh, west to east, uh, that would be great. Just strafe the town, and then we can start moving uh, north towards the command tent. We're on the south side of town right now. 
Alright, solid copy. I'm gonna relay one, that. Six, one, one. They seem to be having a good time. I'm sure they're fine. One, six, one, yeah. one. So I'm gonna say we're gonna hit one, six, the this is all. east Go side for one, of town. Six, hammer. Stand by for helicopter. We have several of your infanteers with us. Uh, do we have a position for an LZ? Friendly. So if we're gonna go one eight seven. That LZ, that's the only safe LZ right now. Oh, uh, we're gonna shell directly behind us in the field. Can try to set down south of tier bed and have them that's assault okay. north Just to stay us. Warrior. One eight seven. Copy admit. that. I'll verify if, if they. That's what they want to do. Confirm. We're gonna need to calculate. Yeah, that's fine. We'll be fine. We're getting shelled. That means someone must have at least heard where the one six. This is Kinzel. Yeah, I can okay. see that. So, you guys Go heard six. one. Yeah, you guys one, are eight, very excited to drop the south side yeah, of Tierra in the seven, south north. Over. One eight seven. Elevation is going to be two Copy. We're starting two, to clear zero. town. Uh, Sunset, if you guys uh, want to get even spicy, you can late. sit down right in the middle. Copy that. Extra spice. That uh, sounds like a plan. Molotov 6, Glenka 7. I'm going to wait for radio traffic to signal that we're firing. Molotov 6, Glenka 7. Basilisk, this is 1-7. Uh, Molotov 6, to throw up smoke. Or Dagger, this is 1-7. At current location, so air assets don't engage them. Red smoke is friendly assets. Red smoke is friendly assets. Let's copy on red smoke. Red smoke, friendly asset. Uh, adjust Dan, to 185. Go for Dan. 185, same elevation. Smoke. All right, Negative, we've got an LZ just, just a hair outside of town here. We're dropping Gun guys light. now. Stand by. One six one one. Go for one six. Got a uh, small reinforcement party dropped at the south side, coming north to y'all over. One six. This is striker. Over. One six two one one. Um, Friendly marker is accurate. We are currently inside the enemy CP capturing. Go for striker. Uh, striker to 1 6. We are zeroed in on the eastern side of town. Do you want us to begin shelling? Over. Stand by. We're uh, clearing this CP. We might have you guys actually move up if we can capture this. Roger that. Standing by for new fire mission. Over. On the off right, chance yeah. that we have to move these mortars, we don't have anything to move it besides throwing it on our back. Correct? Incorrect. We can't throw them on our back. Oh, shit. The okay. game doesn't have... Again, the mod did not put that in the thought. Okay. Uh, dude, that, that's fine. Our yeah, guys so we'll moving. just make them again. <laughs> okay. Okay, what the fuck? How do I... I'm trying to draw lines on the map. Oh, okay. Heal of the town, heal of the town. With the pencil tool? Anyone down there? Yeah. How do I delete them? Yes. Go to the pencil the tool, of hover over the line, and yeah. then X will show up. Yes. And then I just click on the X? Yep, left click. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. All it's doing is... Uh... Drawing a new line where that X is. Uh, get rid of the protractor or the compass. Oh shit. Oh! Apache just went by us. Okay. Oh, it's, it's taking fire from the helicopter behind it. Okay, so that was those missiles were misses. Okay, yeah, both uh, MI8s are on it. Okay. Oh, fine. and it's dead. It crash landed near us to the. Okay, that's fine. 255. I'm 
just gonna keep... Move one from Hilo, run one. Well, that was exciting. <laughs> uh, so I get... damn it, I want to do map. Yeah, goddamn, uh, Gar uh, Gar I was saying if the project is up, it won't delete. Ah, uh, that's probably why then. Yeah, I don't know why. Alright, let me... It's okay. like a lay on Move Photoshop or something. That's stupid. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna delete... Nope, it's doing the same fucking thing. Uh, <laughs> that's weird. And now that I've removed my protractor... Let me see if I can put my protractor back in the same exact spot I had it. Okay, that's gonna be fucking close enough. Just have to know to shift everything by a degree or two. Yeah, okay, so it might just be a glitch because it shouldn't be doing that. That's annoying. It's okay. I know I have. I know I can One have up to nine lines. Yeah. And, uh. That's okay. We are okay. Fuck is this cloud shape? Oh, it's a secondary LZ. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. It's got a very interesting uh, icon for it. <coughs> what are you digging? Uh, more dirt oh, piles. Oh, you're building stuff. Yeah, because when you Ow. shoot, when you shoot mortars next to it, it shows like dust going. So it's a cool. Why effect. would you want to do that? One one seven. This is Kinzo. Because <laughs> it looks cool. We we should not be giving away our position. God damn it, Richard. Oh no no. This is like. A centimeter oh. of dust. Yeah, that, that's that's incoming. Yeah. It's okay. We're still okay. The shelling to was it direction two two five with a helicopter. All crash. infantry elements. This is Kinzel. Does anyone read? Kinzel, this is one one. We have uh, captured the town. Um, no major enemy assets. We are on the radio tower at the moment. Over. Copy that. Capture the town of Tirabad. No one's real enemy assets. Correct. No enemy assets in uh, Tirabad at the moment. We are at the radio tower. Excellent work. What is your command structure like? I'm unable to raise 1 6 or 1 7. They're dead. I am in. Over. <laughs> Outstanding. Do you yeah, guys I'm need LZ's well. extract or any sort of assistance? Stop talking. Uh, let me correct myself, Menzel. Um, lane is up, 1-6 is up. Um, we do not need any extractions at the moment. Oh, oh. Copy that. We'll stay on standby for now. BDV in distress. What? No, I'm, I'm looking at the map. Just at all the other stuff that they stuck, and they have VDV in distress. Huh. My hope is that we do not have to go all the way the fuck over there. I wonder if that was the um, Bradley situation. No, it's like way off oh. the OBJ. Oh. Maybe it is some like secondary objective thing. Hope not. <laughs> As much as I enjoy this game, I don't want to be playing it at like 11 o'clock tonight. <laughs> Do we have any vehicles that we can utilize? Uh, no. Personally, Feels... we have that truck, I guess. Well, gonna... it'd be the helicopters. We would we'd get picked up by the helicopters and go oh, yeah. somewhere else. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hammer this is striker, do you read over?
one six. This is Kinsall. Uh, Kinzel, this is 1116, just died to some backblast from an RPG, so I am in over. That is, that is excellent. Be advised, we have fixed wing fast movers in the AO. Let's go over to Terramad now. Yeah, A10 just went over us. Okay. Stay where you're at. No, I'm not going nowhere. <laughs> Stagger to all hammer units, uh, looking for situation update. Over. Seems to still be engaging um, home base. Problem with fast movers. One, so six, fast. two, <laughs> one, one. Go ahead, one, six. We are coming in on this new Apache. It's going to be a quick touch and go. As soon as we land, we're going to build a new helipad uh, so we can get additional supplies in and start setting up defenses at this uh, base. Understood. Over. Yeah, actual gunfire happening now. One six and one seven are back on the ground. Hammer, this is Striker looking, looking for fire mission over. Striker, if you want to keep shelling an OBJ cross, um, we will not be able to get a forward observer for you, but. Uh, we need to start delaying uh, enemy reinforcements from coming into town as we set up defenses. Roger that. We, we will heavily, heavily shell, shell that, that area. Over. All right. Stand by for fire mission. Stand in by. OBJ cross. Zoop. Okay. Jesus. All right, Helipad has been placed. We need people to go dig it and uh, construct it. It's just east of here. So equip your E tools and you'll see it when you get close. All right, Azimuth 154. Azimuth 154. Mm -hmm. We are going to go range. Yeah, a range 200. Oh, I know, for a second I said 800. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Elevation 200. Azimuth 154. Right. Good lane. All right. All right. I'm going to say just we're just going to keep firing until I tell you to stop. All right. You all should have about 10 mags of everything. Oh, thank you. Okay. Fire when ready. Bye. Actually, no. Let's go 15 rounds per gun. Okay. All right. So whatever you fired 18, is fine. So it's full max. Okay, fine. 18 rounds per gun. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> My LCD was having a hard time with that.
This looks correct. Rounds complete. Rounds complete. What's the status of tier bed? The helipad has been placed. We are uh, able to uh, accept new supplies and start building new defenses. Uh, AGS sixes would be fucking great right now if we can get some fully automatic grenade launcher. Yeah, solid copy. Good buddy. We'll see what we can get you. Just uh, you gotta hold your position until Seventh Panzer relieves you. They're expecting or they're receiving a lot of resistance up on that north and south MSR. Uh, Eight ten flybys have been a real problem coming out of the air base. We'll uh, update you if they get close. Good copy. Yeah, we're getting um, strafed by that A-10, uh, but it's not really doing much to us. Uh, it's <laughs> yeah, just being annoying right it. now. <laughs> Solid copy. Challenge right, the A-10. Speed. Now we're doing some real fucking mathematic hours now. Yeah. I'm literally measuring the screen. Go for six. Why? <laughs> so I can get. Are they still exposed out in that field? We're gonna be moving them in. Uh, we just set up the helipad, and I was just gonna call from the supplies. Look like they just landed. Good deal. Smell like copy. The fuck was that? Kilo's rearming. Oh, oh. Got a battery. Alright, just stay behind cover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Directly in front of us. It's okay, they didn't get did anybody get hit? No, no. No, not even. Okay. <laughs> I just sounded real close. Uh oh, I hear the sounds yep. of wind coming. Hey, did you hear us calling about the already positions? No, I did not. Are there already positions that I need to know about? Roger, my boy should be marking them or already has. I've strafed the fuck out of them. Everyone should mostly be dead there, but I'm going to go hit it again to make sure. <laughs> Copy. Sounds good. We're going to keep setting up defensive here. Um, Holy shit. And okay. then we're going to just hold way... until Panzer gets here. That's. I think that's going to be way beyond us. Wow, well, I don't even see it. It's at the. It's way south. Yeah, that's way past us, because our range is oh. maxed out. If it was, like, half the distance from where Trinidad was, we'd be okay. All right, let us get back on the guns. Let's keep shelling that. Yep. Another... One, five, four, two, zero, zero. Uh, how many did you say you wanted? Another 18. Copy. Eric, I'm going to build you a AGS in that box. <laughs> yeah, we've been going it sounds like we're going to be relocating Somebody soon, though. Somebody help me break down this oh, yeah, fucking yeah. sandbag wall that's in the middle of this path. <laughs> Somebody help me break this fucking thing down. Yeah, it's uh, on the plus side. Well, I mean, we've been shelled a bunch.
yeah, they're bracketing us, but uh, nothing's actually killing us. I'm gonna have to remove one of these fucking things. Yeah, nothing thing. kills you until it does. Okay, I'm back. All right, we're gonna stay silent for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> we seem to have made um, them unhappy. Yeah, I've got to move one of these dirt mounds. Yeah. Because every time yeah. I get off the gun, I uh. I'm on top of my gun. <laughs> well, you know, that's got the shrapnel at bay. Probably not, though. Oh, you need a whole bunch of mags. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> and I'm using an Xbox controller, so I'm very limited as to what I can do. Yeah. That sounds like a lot of shit coming our way. No, it's all in the town. Oh, okay. Oh, well. Yeah, this is why I'm glad that we moved inside the tree line. Yeah. yeah. One, six, that was two, a real good call. This is Dagger, go ahead. One six. Uh, do we have eyes on what is happening on the east side of town? Most of our defenses right now are going up on the west side. I would like to know if we need to move to the east side. West side. Uh, negative at the moment. We can conduct a little aerial sweep if you'd like. Dan's having a blast. It sounds like. Yeah, if you could do a flyover and report back what's coming up that southern MSR, that would be great. Hammer, this is Striker. Do you read over? I copy that. We'll take a look. Okay, yeah, we should all have 10. Go for Striker. Uh, we have received counter battery fire. Everyone is okay. We have not taken any hits. Uh, however, we are going to stay silent for a little bit from hitting uh, OP Cross. Uh, probably gonna give it a couple of minutes, and then we're gonna continue shelling again. Over. If you guys want to actually move into tier bed, we have secured uh, pretty much all of tier bed at this time. We can set up additional mortars in the center of town for you guys to hit cross at an easier angle, and additional targets to the further south. What six? This is Kinzel. Roger, Roger that. We're gonna begin moving, moving to the, the town. town. All right. Go for one six, Kinzel. We'll Coming just leave in. this we stuff set up. one Abrams on the MSR to the east, approximately one kilometer east of town. So, Tyler, come yeah. with us. Copy. I'm going to set up some... Uh, I'm going to grab eight rounds in my backpack. Shoulder-mounted rockets. Yeah, actually, that way. Yeah, fill, uh, up your, can, fill up your backpack with ammo. Yeah, I did. Copy that. The Abrams eight, is yeah, currently eight facing eight is, eight to is the, the east. Mess. His back is to town. <laughs> okay. You might have a good shot. Yeah, I, I see you. Um, let's send a fire team out, see if we can figure out what that is, and uh, report back. Road up ahead. Is there a road? Oh, nice. yeah, I do see it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, is this the dirt road? I don't think this is the I dirt I saw a vehicle road. on it, so it looks like at least an improved road. I'll pull guys from this uh, bunker on the west side. Stand by. We're going to want to stay in the tree line. Yeah, stay in the tree line. Just keep following me. Okay. Should we still be expecting civilians with fucking uh, small arms? Yes. Gotcha. Just, they are not aggressive, so... Go ahead, 1-1. One, one. Don't go crazy. Yeah. I'm going to check the map. Reminds me of the last fucking op that I did with Harrison. He fucking unloaded an entire fucking. Oh, well, that was in the town belt. or whatever. Yeah, half a belt of a 50 cal One, six, straight into it. <laughs> Go for one sec. We'll have to do another one. I advise you also have an Abrams still east of town in the field on the roughly north or east southeast corner of Tirabat. He is currently engaging into town. Uh, just an FYI, guys, should be making sure Copy. you're going straight south. Can you do a gun south. run on it and just delay it a little bit? We're trying uh, to get uh, fire team over there, so. anti-tank to deal but with yeah, it. Yeah, straight south. 
I'm sending okay. the RPG team two men over. Okay, so just this is the affirmative. Lead. We're pestering okay. him right now. Okay. Yep. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just yeah. Just keep following. Yep. Finally, helicopter just went um, over the hill to us now. That's fine. That road should. The road to our left should disappear fairly shortly. One six. This Can't is Kinsall. Go for six. Abrams on the hill is destroyed. <laughs> Fan fucking tastic. We're still sending our rocket team over there to help watch for any additional threats. Absolutely. Abrams on the MSR is still operational, though he's still facing away from Tirabat. Amra, this is Striker. We are still, still making, making our way toward uh, Tirabad. Over. I feel like we should be getting close. Let's start. Oh, well, I'm seeing fire straight south. Do fire? Oh, that I would make vehicle. sense. Uh, civilian. It's a civilian car. Yeah, I just, just, oh, I just leave it alone. Yeah. Someone just parked in the. Oh, no, they're dead. <laughs> I'm going to say <laughs> that. I didn't see the smoke. Yeah, we're, yeah. if you see the, the smoke yeah, columns, that, that's then. probably oh. the town. Yeah. But yeah, the, the car is also on fire. So oh, wait. Dead. No, it's not. What is this smoke? No. Oh, well, is this the shelling from before? It's very possible. The uh, the, the rockets or whatever. That yeah, this is sense. just. Yeah, this is just all burnt out forest. So be careful; the fire will kill you. <laughs> I had to learn that the hard way. Essentially, fire is hot. No one should be surprised. <laughs> I guess I was more surprised that they actually added things for the fire. <laughs> Just, uh... All right, you guys still with me? I, I think so. Here. I've lost visual. Uh, yeah. Well, I still hear gunfire from the right. Do um, we know what that um, explosion was? What was going on? Uh, yeah, I just crossed... Oh, I see... I see one of you. Okay. This is... That's me. Okay. One I got six, Richard. One seven. Okay. Oh, Go for six. That sounds like a bad thing. Oh, that's a grenade launcher. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm not trying to get close to that fucking grenade launcher. Uh, we're getting closer yep. to it. Uh, let's move to the east. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully, that friendly's shooting at something. Okay, I see the town. I see the I building. See, yep. I see the town as well. Are you guys still? Did you guys move up the hill? A little bit, or no, you guys still... still in the woods? I see you. I'm directly to your left. Okay, uh, say... just form up on me. Let's rally up on yeah. my position. Gotcha. This way, we have everybody. We'll go into the town together. Yeah, uh, Tyler, straight ahead this way. Yeah, I got you. I'm here. You said uh, to your left. I immediately look right. <laughs> All right, I'm with you. Oh, I... All right, I got okay. Hammer is a striker. We have eyes on the town. We are making our way from the north to your pause. Over. On the plane. Hey guys, how you doing? All right. How the fuck are we gonna get past these dragons' teeth? Is that what they're called? Yes. Do they hurt you? It's barbed wire. It's possible. Probably. Hey. Cross oh. this hey, guys. Go to your left, like another fifty feet. Thank you. And thank you. <laughs> I feel like we're past fifty feet. I do too, but I also didn't see a lot of. Oh, it's oh, Abrams. it's here. We're just about to shoot that Abrams we saw earlier. Did you find it? Yeah, just keep going that same direction. 
Oh, so it was Putin. Okay, so we had to keep going. Complaint is bad with estimations. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this okay. is more like. Okay, here we go. Whatever. Distance is a vague concept. Ah. Realistically, I'm at the road, just slightly east. Of... I see you. Uh, one six to one one. Uh, can I get a set rep on uh, the western side of town? Uh, yeah, nothing much at the western side of town. It's pretty quiet over here. Over. Comrades. All right. Greetings, comrades. Just, just, just form up right here. Copy. I can build a additional recoilless just on the edge of that northernmost bunker if you want one. My dude sounds like he's gonna die. For yeah, yeah. Time. This bunker up the road here, <laughs> there's a uh, beautiful little natural trench here. Would be a great spot for that. Over. Right in front of you. Go ahead and start building. Hammer this, this is striker. We are now in the town. Where do you want us? Uh, meet up at the command post. It's the uh, two-story building with the destroyed radio tower uh, in the center of town. That's where oh. I'm at right now in the courtyard. Right that on, on the way. way. And then I'll have you uh, place trenches where you guys want additional uh, mortars, and I can build some new ones for you. Ooh, somebody got fancy with the sandbags over here. One six two air assets, dagger and basilisk. The front door somewhere. There's fire here too. Watch out for that. Okay, this is all walled off. I'm gonna go around the other way. Oh man. Oh, we could probably hop the stone fence we got on this connex spot. Oh, well, that works too. Uh, 16211, feel free to break down any uh, enemy fortifications you guys do not need at this time. If they're just getting in your way, feel free to just break them down. Hello! Oh! Uh, all right. We've taken the town. We are setting up the fences. We have recoilless launchers facing that way. We have the enemy or the friendly launcher team uh, heading back east to try to deal with the Nabrams. Uh, what do you guys need from me? I can build. I can have you guys build some new uh, mortars. Hell, right here if you guys want in this courtyard. Hey, um, one six is one one. Anyway, you can disassemble the recoilless and put it somewhere else. This spot's not working. Probably the best to just put them right here. We have decent cover, and uh, it'll kind of shield us a little bit with the buildings. All right. Unless, Richard, you got a better idea. I mean, I want to put them on top of a roof, but I know it's a bad idea. All right, cool. they're set. Feel free to start I mean, building. Yeah, uh, Thank one, you. one, I can break that down. Or actually, you can just dis disassemble it, and I'll place it in a new, uh, new spot. Oh, Pete, is there an arsenal nearby? I'm not. Uh, one one, I'm coming to your position. Pete, to try is to there get an arsenal on nearby? I wanted exactly. Thank you. He's gone. Uh, yeah, there's an arsenal on the top of the building. However, you gotta walk through the fire. I'm gonna build a <laughs> actual <laughs> arsenal after I fix this recoil that's down the road. I was like, I don't want to use that one. Uh, but there is an actual <laughs> arsenal up on top of this building. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, be advised, we got uh vehicles moving through town. Uh, we're trying to get eyes on and figure out what's going on. I only see two more mortars. Well, it's okay. One, one, is we'll that, just... that sounds like it's I in your direction. What's going on? Probably I wouldn't bad. worry about it. Just both of you guys get on the guns. I'm going to start uh, doing my map. Did roll up on the north side of town earlier. They. Oh, that's that's fucking worse. Yeah. Police uh, are enemies currently. They are not happy with what we're doing here. Go fig. Hey, uh, Rich. Yeah. Richard, what's the what's the command to delete a line on PC? There's no on the map. It just it should just be a left click with the pencil thing out. There's no command for it. Ah, Jesus. Oh shit. Oh no, no, fuck. 
Oh, oh, that ND. Okay. Oh, that oh, that finger hit it. Dagger, this is one okay. Yeah, there's no command to delete a pencil line. It's just a left click. Yeah. Counter battery. Um. Oh, my compass didn't load. I'm gonna say. It's enough to get in a fucking building. West, east. That's okay. All right, I got the lines deleted. I just used my fucking mouse. Yeah. Uh, okay. It's kind of annoying. Let I got me... another mortar up as well. Okay. We okay. are. Where are we? Wasn't there another mortar here? Well, you had another mortar. Yeah. Oh. We had. Right, hold on. Here, if you're able to, uh, with yes. smash shit. How do you build sandbags? Oh, that's in the build thingy. Hang on a second. Okay. Right. Sandbags are going up. I've got my, I've got my ruler back out. Uh, the artillery is now within uh, range. One six two. Any air assets in the AO? I'm gonna start doodling. This is Kinsol. Gotcha. Uh, thanks for helping deal with that fucking Apache. Uh, how is it looking during the surrounding area for you guys? Uh, so far pretty quiet. The Apache's nice and dead. Uh, east end of town, I believe the Abrams on the MSR is still up. We're sort of engaging as we can. Okay. Uh, let's prepare our... Fire mission. Kinzol, this is gotcha. one seven. You have friendlies by the burnt out uh, Abrams. Lift fire. So Azimuth Copy is that. going friendlies to by be the out Abrams. Copy. one seven two. Uh, Elevation. One six. This is one seven. Go for a six. One Abrams down. Love to hear it. Three, two, five. One seven. This is Kinsol. Do you have infantry in the tree line near that uh, down to the east of the right. uh, of the tank on the MSR? <clears throat> All right, stand by. Gun up. Near the downed what? The the downed Abrams on the MSR. Just a repeat. That was one seven two elevation three two five. Affirmative. One seven two elevation three two five. Gotcha. Yep, gun laid. Oop, hold on. Uh, Hammer, this is a striker. Uh, is that already positioned to the south still in play for us? I am ready to strike it. Over. Uh, I do not know. Uh, the last call I heard was the air assets were hitting that. Um, so I would check with them. If you guys want to hit it, Roger go that. for it, but the air assets were the ones who marked that, not me. Alright. Basilisk or dagger, this is striker. Do you read me over? Hang on, one's landing. Basilisk or or dagger. This is striker. Do you read over? They're probably busy. Yeah, one's landing, so he's not going to be on comms. I can yeah. I mean, we can just hit it. It's not like this friendly's on that. Yeah, but I want to make uh, one six two air asset. Hey, air, air asset, go for one six. Uh, mortars are trying to reach you guys. Uh, is that artillery position marked on the map just south of OBJ two or bed still active? Affirmative, it is still active. Uh, did you hear that? Striker. Affirm. Affirmative. Uh, striker copies. Can one of the air assets just uh, hover nearby to, to provide forward observation? observation? Over. 
copy that. We will absolutely do that for you. <laughs> okay, so again, 172, uh, 325. 1 6, Gun this is 1 7. Gun laid. Go for 6. We are abandoning our position at cross point. We are unsupported and leaving. Oh, that sounds like complaining. Copy. Fall back to town uh, <laughs> and start setting up additional trenches and defenses there. I will, uh, if you want to head back to the command post, we can figure out the range and I can start setting up um, sandbag walls and gun emplacements for you. Acknowledged. I would highly suggest that our troops take advantage of all the money that NATO spent with Raytheon and steal javelins. <laughs> yes. Kim Sol, this is one six. Javelins are very good at killing Abrams. Break, break, Kim Sol, this is one six. You have three armor units moving into town from the southeast. On the hill, we are currently engaging. At least one main battle tank, possibly anti-air. You got that, Harrison? direction uh southeast so uh not your direction the other way i'm gonna try to set up uh sandbags that way and see if we can get something uh for you guys let me see the range of this shit striker to air assets do we have forward observation capability or are you currently engaged over I don't want to start slinging rounds if I don't think we're actually going to hit something. Eh, we've got plenty of extra ammo. That's, I think. Let me check. God. Why the fuck are they not on comp? Why do they not listen to me? <laughs> uh, someone has complained about fuck. air assets being out of range, even with the backpack. That's, yeah. So. I'm All right, well, that. fuck it. We're just going to send it. Hell uh, yeah. Five. Six rounds per gun. Again, azimuth is 172, uh, elevation uh, 325. All right. Fire when ready. Guys? Up we lost Rich, maybe? Uh, Fire when ready. I am firing. Server I am crash. Not. Server crashed. Oh no! Oh no! <sighs> Boo! I was oh, like, because no. when I got on the gun, I sank into the floor. And I was Thank like, God! I, I thought it was just me. <laughs> Boo! Uh, okay. You know, oh, wait, wait, it's we it's probably relaunching. built. We, we probably built. Wait. Well, I don't know oh, if yeah. we built too much stuff. It was probably the oh, town. Yeah. That would be why I lagged out. It, oh, it so bad. Oh, it crashed. Oh, oh no. Oh That's no. We asked rip. too much of it having three Abrams and two helicopters in the air. <laughs> <laughs> so I was wondering and, why I lost and, control. And again. an A10. Yeah. And uh, if it had just been a few more seconds.